that crazy, insane day that I will never forget. Hi everyone, welcome to Battlestar Collectica, the channel dedicated to the memorabilia and collectibles surrounding the Galactica universe. Before we dive into today's episode, I want to thank everyone who has subscribed to the channel. I really appreciate it. There's so little classic Battlestar Galactica anywhere these days that we need to stick together. Now, the date was July 31st, 2003, and the world's largest collection of Battlestar Galactica screen-used authenticated memorabilia was going up for auction via Profiles in History. If you know anything about that company, they're no longer around, but they were the number one auction house for movie and TV props during the 1990s and 2000s. Now, for those of us who were aware of this auction, this was going to be a opportunity to see some incredible props from the original Battlestar Galactica TV series and its sequel, Galactica 1980. And as I flip through the pages of the auction catalog, just take a look at what was for sale that day. Now, I participated in this auction with the hope of picking up something that was used on the original series. Even though I am a toy collector, I wanted something that would connect me directly to the show, but I was in for a big surprise. It turns out that the world of toy collecting is vastly different than the world of movie prop collecting. That world is for high rollers, and that is what I found out the day that this auction took place. The prices were crazy. They became insane. It turns out that a mysterious buyer who only would be referred to as Starbuck of all names was purchasing most of the props in this auction at astronomical prices. And it became very crazy, insane, and a little disappointing to most of us that wanted something from the original series. As each lot came up for auction and I started to see the prices that were being realized, it dawned on me that the fix was in. This was no place for a toy collector on a budget. In fact, of the five or six fellow Battlestar Galactica fans that I knew of who participated in this auction, none of us won a thing. What usually happened is that you placed a bid and within the last 30 seconds, you were totally outbid by two or three mysterious absentee bidders that drove the prices up to astronomical levels. In fact, this mysterious absentee bidder, codenamed Starbuck by the employees of the auction house, ended up winning close to two-thirds of everything you see in this catalog related to Battlestar Galactica, Galactica 1980, and Buck Rogers. To this day, no one knows who this mysterious absentee bidder is. I will tell you that they spent close to half a million dollars on the props that you see in this catalog. And there was a rumor that it was all shipped to Japan, that it was a big classic series fan who fell in love with Battlestar Galactica when the movie Battlestar Galactica was a huge theatrical hit there. What's interesting is that most of what you see in this catalog has never appeared in public again. A few pieces have resold over the last decade, but that private collector, as far as I know, still owns the most intense, complete Battlestar Galactica collection in existence. So what did I learn by participating in a very small way in this auction? First off, Battlestar Galactica is a very popular TV series. Everything that you see in this catalog related to the TV show sold that day. There was no unsold lots. Secondly, I've learned since that day that a lot of people who participate in movie and TV memorabilia auctions are not actually collectors, they're investors. This has become a big problem in the world of Star Wars. Recently, there's been a lot of original trilogy props for sale that have sold for astronomical prices and not being purchased by collectors, they're being purchased by investors who are hoping to flip them down the road at a greater profit. So that is a story of a crazy day in Battlestar Galactica memorabilia collecting. Please let me know if you participated in this auction way back in 2003. Please subscribe to the channel. Give this episode a thumbs up. Please share it with your fellow Galactica fan. I will see you in the next episode. Have a great Galactica day, everyone.